Hi and welcome. My name is Tolan and I am the co-founder of Productivity Me. In this video, we're going to look at a method in order to jump to the next active workbook that we have open in our profile, assuming that we have multiple workbooks open in Excel. We are going to achieve this primarily by using the keyboard combination of control and the tab key. So with that, let's get started. Now here in Excel, we have three individual documents. I'm gonna click them and make sure that they are all active. Now we have these three individual documents and sometimes we might want to scroll between these. One way to achieve this would be to press the Alt key and the Tab key, which would allow you to scroll between all of your applications. However, there's a specific keyboard shortcut which will allow you to cycle between only the active Excel applications, those windows that you have in Excel which you have not minimized. To achieve this, you would press the Control key and the Tab key. Pressing the Tab key, you would go to the item that you most recently used. Pressing the Tab key a second time, you would go to those other individual worksheets. So again, you press the Control key and the Tab key, and it would cycle between these three workbooks because we currently have three workbooks open. An alternative way that you could achieve a similar result is by pressing Alt-Tab and scrolling to the items that you want to go to. But if you have lots of different application windows open, this isn't always the most efficient way. Alternatively, you can use your mouse and come down, scroll or hover above this Excel icon, then scroll over to the item that you want and click with your mouse and you would be able to move to that. Now, this keyboard shortcut of control tab has a little bit of a nuance. If you say have minimized an individual window, so we're gonna minimize this blue window. Then when you press control tab, it will only cycle between the active windows. So again, if we had all three of these open and active, it would cycle between these three active windows. However, if we have this window minimized here in your spreadsheet, that window, when we cycle between control tab, it will not show that individual window. Thus, the control tab keyboard shortcut can be really efficient when interacting with multiple Excel workbooks and you want to scroll between, or rather tab between, those individual windows. An alternative might be to press the Alt key and the Tab key, which you would allow you to tab or toggle between all of your programs. And then lastly, you could of course scroll down and hover above your Excel icon on your Quick Launch toolbar. And then once you see the individual Excel item that you want to bring up, you would click that and Excel would automatically make that your active window. So in our next video, we'll look at a similar keyboard shortcut, that of Control Shift Tab, which will allow you to cycle between active Excel windows in the opposite order. So check that out in our next video. And as always, thanks for watching.